All right, Kimberly Young, Executive Director of Hearts of Hope. How are you? Good morning. I'm great. How are you? I'm good. How are things at the Empire? Since the early 80s, right? Yes, the Rape Crisis Center wow. started in the early 1980s. And then in the early 1990s, we started the Children's Advocacy Center. And then in the early 2000s, we started the Sexual Assault Nurse Examiners. Program. Wow. So, Kim, uh, coming up next Thursday, not this coming, but next on the 17th, the third annual Beacons of Hope Breakfast. What is this all about? Who are you honoring? So we are honoring all of our community partners, law enforcement, Department of Children and Family Services, investigators, prosecutors that work with us, and of course, survivors of crimes of sexual yeah. abuse. I mean, you know, it, it truly does take a team, especially with the work you do. Yeah. I mean, you, you've already mentioned law enforcement and first responders and folks like that. They're indeed part of all of this. Um, let's talk about, uh, you know, the rate. I mean, the number of folks, it's a scary stat. Yeah. The number of folks who will be sexually abused, the number of kids who will be sexually abused is scary. Yeah. It's estimated that about 1 in 10 kids will experience some form of child sexual abuse before they reach their 18th birthday. And it's also estimated that 1 in 6 women will have either an attempted or a completed rape yeah. in their lifetime. And this is why you guys are so important because, one, if we're going to get the evidence, I mean, and you guys do so many different things, but to get the evidence to help put these criminals behind bars, it requires the, the delicate work you guys do, what the first responders do, what law enforcement does. It truly is a team effort. Exactly. It really is. We uh, couldn't do this without our partners, our law enforcement investigators, DCFS. We work hand in yeah. hand with them, and we really try to make sure that we are here for a lifetime from that point of disclosure all the way through the yeah. investigation, arrest, and hopefully prosecution. About 30 seconds here, Kim. Um, how can folks get tickets for your breakfast? So it's real easy. You can scan the QR code. You can visit us at theheartsofhope.org. Call our office at 337-269-1557. We really just want you to yeah. come out and honor survivors. Yeah, City Club at River Ranch, and again, honoring survivors and the good folks that have done the work with Hearts of Hope. Kimberly Young, good to see you. Good to see you too, thank right, you. Let's go over to Adam, he is standing by and he's got a little something about uh, weather.